Okay, man, I'm to street and I've just come to New Bond Street and um, I kind of heard about this a while ago but Pete's was showing me that there's a new Montclair store somewhere around here in Bond Street. Now I'm going to pass through to see what he's saying. I've actually got a jacket that needs repairing so I'm going to try and see if they can repair the jacket. Um, so yeah, I'm going I'm to go in there, I'm going to pass through but yeah, this is, um, this is Bond Street so for some of you that don't know or have never been here, this is where a lot of the high-end retailers are. Um, think of it like that street that I went to in Hamburg where there was lots of really high-end retailers. This is the equivalent in London. You will find all the designer stores down here. Um, yeah, all the big boy brands will all be around here, man. Like, you can see Philip Plain over there. So yeah, chuffed to be here, man. Let's, uh, let's see if we can't find this Montclair store. Let's see if we can't see what's well, cracker lacking around here. Oh yeah, and it's proper cold as well. But yeah, a lot, of the, a lot of the big money in London is around here, man. People come shopping here from all over the world. I mean, wow, just look at this stuff, look at that there. Crazy. Yeah, so, it's all art shops. People selling crazy types of art, man. Mad thing. Leave a ton. I thought only one place sold Louis Vuitton and that was Louis Vuitton. There you go. Anyway, let me see if I can't find this Montclair store, man. So, um, signing out, yo. Back in two bits. That's Coach over there. I've actually got to go and see them later on. Just come, this is um, some art gallery. Bell staff is here. Yeah, I'll come down here and I'll cover this street properly, man, because there's some really cool stores. Bell staff house, as you can see there, some nice bits. Zegna's over there. RWC, they do like really popular watches and stuff. Yeah man, this, this street is banging man. Lots going on. Damn man, check out this Louis Vuitton store though. Jeez. Whoa. That is mental. Damn. I definitely gotta get a picture of that. Wow. Goodness. That is just crazy. Crazy. Um, Sierra submitted that for me. Yeah. Louis Vuitton, boy. Whoa, this store looks next level. More big boy brands. Bulgari's here. Mad thing. Oof, too much money around here, boy. Too much money. Right, I've located it, man. Um, I thought it, from the outside it looks like it should be bigger, but it's quite small, so... Anyway, we'll, we'll take a buff over there, I'll put the camera on and we'll have a quick look. Look at this boy, big boy Bentley here, man. Lots of money around these ends. Different ends. Cheers, mate. Hello, do you have a menswear section? Yeah, just upstairs. Upstairs, thank you. Oh, hello. How long have you guys been opened? I knew you were opening a store ages ago, <laughs> but I didn't know you guys were open already. Yeah, we're open last year. When? Not too long, at June. June? That's ages ago, in the summer? Yes, summer. Oh, I never knew. Okay, cool. And this is your second store in London, isn't it? You have one in Knightsbridge. We have five. In London? Put Stores or boutiques? Concessions? Because you have concessions in Harrods and Selfridges as well. Harrods and Selfridges, they, they all boutique. They're very small. This is the flagship. Ah. The biggest one in London. Right. So where else is where else is your store in London then? Uh, Knightsbridge. Knightsbridge. Here. Happy Nicole. 
We have two. Harvey Nichols. Harvey Nichols, Harrods, Harrods, Selfridge. Selfridge. And um, one. And that's one. it, that's five. Yeah, that's five. Ah, okay. Interesting. Yeah. Thank you. Whoa. Gee, look at the badge, though. Well, is this is this a special collection? Because I've never seen this all black badge before. Is it something yeah. new or? No, this is uh, also Montclair. It's the another line. We'll see, you will see more detail. It, what's the name of the line? Because I know you do something. You do the Gamblu staff and all yeah, this. Yeah, Gamblu is on your left. Yeah. And this is the more, the another. I was the another line. They yes. have more detail with the fur, and even you will see the fabric. This yeah. Design. Oh, they interesting. All detail because and the color use a different. I love. Yeah, it looks really cool. Yes. Very nice. Thank you. So you are our loyal customers. Uh, you don't want to know how many ja Montclair jackets I've got. <laughs> I've probably had, I've probably had well over a hundred jackets. Really? <laughs> Um, have you had a look in our new gambling? Just come for last week. Really? Let's, ha let's have a look. <laughs> this looks funny. <laughs> this looks like. Why does it look like Burberry? I don't know. Oh, I thought yeah. maybe. I don't know. Maybe there was a collaboration or something. Yes. Okay. Now, this pattern is no longer belongs to Burberry. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Hey. You're not the first one to ask me like yeah. that. Yeah. It's different. Definitely different. Mm. Is there anything that you like particularly for men? Is there anything that stands out for you that you think is quite cool? Yeah, I think mean, this one's quite cool. I don't know you like the baseball jacket. Yes, this like a bummer. Like, yeah. That is nice, cool. it's unique, definitely. And even this one? Mm hmm Simple. Yeah. I love this. That one is nice. Yes. Yeah. I like that one. Mm. If you get smaller size, I will take this one. <laughs> I will tell you. Oh, if there was a smaller size, you'd go for that? Yeah, nice. but it's only for men too. This is definitely new. I haven't seen this before. Yeah, what? Raincoat. What's that made from? For reading. Sorry? The raincoat. Raincoat? Oh, it's different. Hmm, I like. This is... I haven't seen this anywhere. Just come out, because I was just in your store. You got a store in Hamburg. Oh. I just came from there. I didn't see any of this you stuff. Should go, you should come here. Mm. Come here yeah. <laughs> this stuff is, mate. That's beautiful, man. Look at that. Jeez. If I have to keep the jacket, I need to send them and they want the jacket clean. Otherwise, we can ask like by email. Please. In this way. So send me the pictures yes. of the problem. Send me an email. Okay. I will give you my personal email. Okay. In this way, I can assist you personal level and... Uh, and send me the pictures, send me the email, and I'm going to forward to our customer service. Wee, this store is cool, boy. Gee, look at that, mate. Montclair Grenoble. I had that piece, very nice. This same one had it. And I had that piece. Canmere, is it? Canmore? Canmere? Yep, Camarook. Had that. This stuff is, the Grenoble stuff is super warm, boy. Ah, oh, look at the kids. 
kids, oh, kids stuff is cool, man. Look at that. <laughs> very cool. But I bet they're very expensive. I'm going to be too scared to look at the price on this boy. 510, jeez. Big boy cheese. Oh wow, look at that. That is so nice. Very nice. Skis, you know. Bloody hell. I want one of those now. Have a good day, mate. Cheers. So that's it, man. That is the Montclair store. So as I said, I had a jacket that was returning, so they said they want me to dry clean it, and they're going to either send it back to Italy or they're going to maybe even give me a new jacket. So that's why it's always good to keep the receipt, chaps. So let's see, man. Let's see what's cracker lacking. Okay, man. Let's see. I'm signing out. I'm going to go to the coach store now. But that's going to be another video, okay? Lots more coming, chaps. Lots more coming. Look what I just found, yo. Look at this. <laughs> well, wait to end the video. Bless us.